Uh, hmm. So Keith on Games on the Table, which everyone should check out, posted a blog, uh, I guess yesterday, a blog post about unboxing videos and how, you know, maybe there is, maybe there isn't any valid reason for them. It's an interest, interesting post. Uh, you should definitely check his blog out in general. Uh, Keith's a pretty good guy. I'm going to do one, uh, despite maybe the vapidity of it. This is where there's Discord. We're in the South Atlantic by Fifth Column Games and Daniel Hodges. It just came today. This is the third printing that I guess was just released. Um, right off the bat, oh, something's at the door. So this is a third edition. Um, impressions right out of the box. The box is a lot bigger than I was expecting. Um, I heard it was big, but the box that came in was a normal-ish size box, but this took up entirely the whole thing. Um, the game doesn't come shrink-wrapped, which is interesting to me, um, and the box got pretty beat up in transit, which is a bit disappointing, especially considering how much I paid for this. Um, let's see, there's a line here. I don't know if that's typical. Um, a little disheartening. But decent quality um, box inside. Thick briefing booklet. I'm guessing these are scenarios, events, whatever. Rules of play. And that's a heavy, thick book. Oh. I'm hoping these aren't. Well, I guess they are. This is all rules. It's going to take me a while to learn this one. Uh, so, 59 pages. Right? Quite thick. Decent quality, not glossy, um, which is good. Minimal artwork in here, which is probably a good thing. Interesting. A couple charts here. Let's see what's a play. Combat chart. Uh, from what I hear, the editions are all exactly the same. So if you have the first edition, this is probably all looking very similar to you. The board comes in two pieces, and each one is not quite the size of a game board, but rather, rather large. Uh, a decent, I wouldn't call it stock, it's cardboard. I mean, it's nice and thick, however, I did take this out before. A little, little tearing here on mine, uh, again, not a huge deal, but, you know, when you pay a premium for a game like this, you. I know it's a small press, but you kind of want it to be pristine. Uh, the map is huge, and I don't know that it needs to be, <laughs> quite honestly. Um, but I guess that's part of what the game is, for better or worse. Counters, uh, decent size stock here. A bit flimsy, honestly, but I think it's because this sheet's so big. Decent artwork. Um, and I like the style of it. It's a little under crisp for me. I'm critiquing it quite heavily. I don't usually do that. More counters. Ooh, I wonder if these are steps. That's what it looks like. I know almost nothing about this game except that it's solitaire and it's about the Falklands. Um, I don't know how it works. I know there are cards which are right here. Um, so that's that's fun for me. I like reading books without reading the back. I like watching movies without seeing the trailer. So knowing nothing about how this game plays, I think I think it'll be a fun experience for me. I like the, the card here. That's Pretty cool. Just one big picture with a little bit of stuff on it. And surprisingly, a bag full of dice. Uh, we have some eights and some fours and some tens, which is cool. Uh, you don't 
would see those in, in regular war games. And that's it, nothing under here. Nothing under here, that's probably what, where I'll, well, I guess that's probably where I'll put my counters. So that's the game. Um, I don't know. I guess I'm a, in a bit of a down mood anyway. I'm a bit underwhelmed. Just by the components, I'm really looking forward to playing this game. I've heard a lot about it. A lot of people say it's, you know, it's their favorite. Um, I wasn't quite ready for the charge to come. It kind of interrupted my not buying anything. Not resolution, but idea. Um, that's cool. Uh, so I, th I think that colors me against the game is just bad timing on its part. That's, that's not the game's fault. So that's the game. I'm really curious to dive into this. See what this whole thing's about. What these events um, and this gigantic rule book. I hope it's well laid out. I don't know if people have trouble learning it. Um, I hope not. I'm not in the mood to struggle to learn a game or to read a poor, poor rule book. Um, let's get everything back in here except that. That's going to go on my nightstand. Yeah, see this? I mean, it is nice. It has a nice textured back. Very heavy. I mean, it's like a Parker Brothers. I don't know if that's even still a company. But, um, I mean, very, very sturdy board. Uh, don't let my poor mood color you against this in any way. So that's where the, there is Discord um, dinged up and all. And hopefully this will be coming to a YouTube video near you very, very soon.